at Hazeltine that year in the Ryder Cup for those two as we go up to Victor Hovland hitting his second at the first from the left rough a little bit earlier. A little bit of a tree to contend with goes up and right. over. Only three birdies today. What a shot from Victor. You make a three at one today. You are making up a lot of ground. And now all of a sudden, Hovland is only four shots back. Hovland now off the birdie at one. Go. Yes. Trying to get held up in the wind. Oh, Victor. Beautifully done right there. Oh, man. Victor, three, three. The only player in the field today to birdie the first two holes. And look where he finds himself now. Just three shots back of the top spot. Hovland with his third. Came up short and left of the green. Got a lot of green to work with, Paul, but must be careful. Anything past the hole tends to run right off the green. Yeah, these guys, that is really yeah. incredible touch out of that St. Augustine kind of Bahia. For Hovland to make birdie here at the seventh. Nicely done, so he's back to 12 under par, a couple under par in his round. For Hovland from 93 yards, coming off his latest birdie, his third of the day at seven. Pretty scary shot. Got to get it past the hole here. You could spin it back in the water. Yep, we've seen it happen time after time, but no problem for Hovland. Set up for a birdie there at the eighth. He played this shot perfectly. Put it behind the hole, spun it back to this point. Got it. What a player this guy is. I tell you what, it took a lot of heart for him to come out on Saturday after making that quadruple bogey nine on his final hole Friday night. Hovland for birdie at the ninth on the hole that uh, wreaked havoc for him. Yeah, I said quadruple bogey nine. It's actually a quadruple bogey eight. And uh, well, yeah. how about a birdie three for a difference of five? Eleventh birdie or better since that quadruple bogey. Twenty-three-year-old from Oslo, Norway. That's an excellent shot. See just the power that Scotty Scheffler has hit it 25 yards in the Texas wedge again. Victor Hovland. We had that on line too and he knows it. He is now two back of Colin Morikawa. Tied with Billy Horschel. So this is the shot back at 13, Robert, that uh, I was just referencing. Mm -hmm. Hoplin was in there, had a hybrid club in his hand. He debilitated over this shot for about five minutes before going back into the bottom of the bag and pulling off this. How about it? Unbelievable. Got it. What an up and down. Just over seven feet, seventh birdie of the day. Just one bogey on his card. Victor Hobbley, yeah, look at that smile at his caddy, Shay Knight, as well. I don't think he can even best case scenario get to 17 and hope that uh, Morikawa trips. But not his best. He's a cutter of the golf ball, John, the whole location on 17, tucked there. Now climbing the slope. Now it crests the ridge. Should go left. Oh, look at this. Did he? Oh, no. Oh, man, what an effort. Generally very decisive, but uh, not on a part of this severity. Best of the day from down there. Was it ever? Oh, we nearly hold it. Yeah. That would have been sensational. Wow. Yeah, the short game in the putting has shown market improvement. It's on the uptick, isn't yes, it? Yes, it is. <laughs> that putt just kept crawling and crawling and the last instant nearly jumped in there. 